Vintage Porsches don't have any built-in driver assist features to keep them from spinning off the road. No active suspension management or lane change or parking assist. Many don't even have air conditioning or radios or even heaters. It's just driving in its purest form, and that ironically is why enthusiasts are drawn to vintage Porsches. My name is Leonard Ziedrich. My father got me started on cars and motorcycles from an early age. From there, it sort of blossomed into this passion about air-cooled Porsches. Why vintage and air-cooled? In this car, you get an experience that you don't get in a modern car. Everything's mechanical, levers. It's really more like operating a machine. There's no PSM, there's no ABS brakes. There's roll-up windows and manually adjusted seats. It's an experience. It's an experience you get that puts you into contact with the road. It's a driving experience. And that's missing from the modern cars. And that's what I like about, about driving a vintage, air-cooled 911. So why Porsche? Porsche got it right. Porsche built a car that people could drive every day. It still was a car that could compete with the big cars like Lamborghini and Ferrari but it was a simple enough machine that people could still work on it themselves. And that was the beauty of the whole car. A car that could race, but a car that you could also drive every day. What's unique about the roads in Northwest Arkansas? Number one, it's the low population density. There's open roads with twisties and turns and straightaways, lush scenery alongside the roads, open spaces well-maintained roads, and that's unique about this part of the country. So the Porsche Club uh, brings together like-minded individuals that have a passion for Porsche. Uh, whether you have a front engine water-cooled or a rear engine air-cooled, we all share the same passion for Porsche. Uh, the club has events for not just the drivers of these cars, but also for the whole family. So it's a family-oriented uh, organization.